Hey what's going on guys my name is Ravi and welcome back to another quick premiere pro tutorial from Ira FX So in this video we'll be learning to quickly replace a file with another file without losing all the effects that are previously applied So let me show you clearly So I have a project I'm working on a project and you can see that I'm using this specific file called snow umbrella So let me show you what this video has got so this is basic magic trick and i applied a couple of effects to it such as i scale this down if you look at this i just scale this down and applied a grid effect so that i get a border so now you might get into a situation where a client asks you to replace this file with an another file and he sends you another file this is the modified video and i want to replace it and not lose the grid effect as well as the scaling properties so you can simply import this modified video into your premiere pro and now you can just hold alt on your keyboard and simply drag this video onto the top of this snow umbrella clip like this and there you go we did not lose any scaling property or the grid effect that we applied so this is how you can simply hold alt on a keyboard and replace the existing video with another one so you might also get into a situation where you want to change the entire video from the project so i'm using the snow umbrella shot the earlier version a couple of times in the project i want to replace it with the modified video across all places so in that case you can again hold alt on your keyboard and replace it with the existing video but there's a much simpler way you can right click on the old video in your project and you can hit this replace footage option and once you do that a pop up opens up and you can just replace it with the modified video so the video is replaced everywhere in your project wherever you're using that specific clip i hope you found this video helpful and if that's the case give us a thumbs up and if you'd like to talk with me regarding visual effects and video editing you can always reach out to me on instagram see you guys next time with another tutorial